Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make this super easy clutch purse out of old denim jeans. So let's get started. First cut off the bottom hem of the pant leg. Then grab a ruler and you're going to measure about 10 inches up the pant leg. Then grab your scissors and cut it straight across. Now make sure you save the rest of the jeans. You never know what DIY project you could use that for. Now that we have our fabric cut out, we're going to make the cover flap for our clutch. Now this is an old clutch that I have. I really like the shape of the cover flap. So I'm just going to trace the shape onto the denim. You can leave it straight if you want to, but I wanted to give it a little bit more style, so I decided to trace the shape out. So after you traced out your shape, you're just going to cut it right behind the line. And take your time cutting so it doesn't get too raggedy. You want it to have a smooth finish. There you go. Now you're gonna turn it inside out. And make sure that top edges line up. Now it's time to close up the bottom of our clutch. You wanna flip the bottom over and turn it about half an inch high. You should use fabric glue, but I ran out, so I'm using regular Elmer's glue that you used to use in school. After one side is glued down, flip it over and glue the other side. Now we're going to glue the bottom closed. Make sure that the glue goes all the way across from end to end. You don't want your clutch to open up on you and all your stuff falls out. Press firmly down on the material, making sure it's really glued together. After it's glued, just flip it over to the right side. Now for the cover flap. So decide how low or how high you want your cover to be. I want the clutch to be a little deeper so it could hold more. So I'm going to fold mine over about halfway down. Now this next step, you could totally skip if you want to. I decided to glue down the inner flap, but if you want, you could just cut the inner flap completely off. You know when you buy clothes, especially shirts and tops, and it comes with extra buttons? Do not lose those. They come in very handy for DIY projects. But if you need buttons, you could just pick some up at your arts and crafts store or somewhere like Michael's.
Now you're going to grab a button and figure out where you want to place it on your clutch. I chose this metallic looking button because most jeans have metal buttons and hardware on them. So this one matches perfectly with the denim. Grab a marker and put a dot where you want the button to go and then sew the button right over that dot. Close the flap and where you feel the button underneath, grab your marker and put another dot. Then grab your scissors and cut a little hole right in that spot. Cut a small hole at first. If it's too small, you can always make it bigger. You don't want to accidentally make it too big. Let me show you the inside. There you go guys, your own DIY denim clutch made from old jeans. It looked a little plain to me, so I decided to dress it up with some lace. Have fun making your own denim clutch purse, and let me know how it turns out. Bye!